Hi, this is Mike with your 60 second ACT tip. Today we're going to talk again about a math problem. Uh, it's a word problem and it can be a little confusing. Let's say that there are six players in a tennis tournament and you have to find out how many different matches will there be so everybody can play against everyone else. Now, what you could do is you could write out a name for each of the six players and count, okay, John plays Sue, Sue plays Jane, Jane plays Tom, that's going to take you forever. But if you know the trick or the rule, uh, it's a lot simpler. So let's take a look at that. Six players. The first player can't play against themselves. It always requires two players. So that first player is going to play against five other players. The second player is going to play against one of those players that's already counted for here, plus four players and then so on and so on and so on. So with six players, if each has to play someone else one time, you would add five plus four plus three plus two plus one, and the answer is 15. There's a total of 15 combinations if you have to have one person playing another person. This is Mike with College Exam Tutor reminding you that if you study a little bit every day, the ACT is a breeze.